Welcome to the HP DesignJet How to Use video series. In this episode, I will discuss the HP DesignJet Z6800 Photo Production Printer's ink system. The ink system is comprised of three components, the ink cartridges, the print heads, and the maintenance cartridge. The HP DesignJet Z6800 uses HP Vivid photo pigment based inks. These inks are formulated to be fade resistant for up to 250 years on certain medias. In addition, the ink is waterproof on certain media such as HP Durable Banner with Dupont Tyvek. This is a perfect commercial off-the-shelf solution to produce durable outdoor maps for the military and drawings for the construction industry. The HP DesignJet Z6800 uses eight ink cartridges. The colors are matte black, which is used when printing on non-glossy media, photo black, which is used when printing on glossy media, chromatic red, light cyan, magenta, light magenta, light gray, and yellow. And yes, all eight cartridges must be installed for the printer to work. As you can see, the ink cartridges are actually very large. They hold 775 milliliters of ink. The starter cartridges that ship with your HP DesignJet Z6800 hold 225 milliliters of ink, so you may want to consider ordering an extra set of ink cartridges. Here are a few things to note about the ink cartridges. Each cartridge is designed so that it will only fit into the corresponding color slot in the printer. If you find that the cartridge is encountering resistance when you are installing it, make sure that you are installing it in the correct slot. There is a manufacturing date stamped on the cartridge. A general rule of thumb is the cartridge should be fine to use as long as it is not older than 30 months past the manufacturing date. The HP DesignJet Z6800 can use the ink cartridges from the 771 and 773 ink product family. You will see this noted on the ink cartridge. Now let's take a look at the print heads. The HP DesignJet Z6800 uses eight print heads and a double swath configuration. Each print head carries two channels or colors, giving you four print heads in one row and four print heads in the second row. This gives the HP DesignJet Z6800 close to a two inch wide print swath. HP uses thermal inkjet technology, which means that heat is being applied in the print head chamber to create a vapor bubble, which then fires through the nozzles onto the paper. Here are a few things to note about the print head. Be careful when handling the print head. Avoid touching the pins and leads and circuitry. Oils from your hands can damage these parts. Like the ink cartridges, the print heads are designed so that you cannot install them in the wrong slot. They do have a warranty based on the date that is stamped on the print head or after 1200 milliliters of ink have flowed through the print head, whichever occurs first. The print heads are extremely durable and do not need to be replaced every time the ink cartridge is replaced. They provide excellent results even when the ink cartridges contain a low level of ink. To maintain optimum print quality, the print heads are automatically tested at regular intervals and automatically serviced when necessary. When a print head eventually needs to be replaced, the front panel will display a message alerting you. Now, let's take a look at the maintenance cartridge. The maintenance cartridge serves a couple of roles. First, it cleans the print heads, and second, it acts as a capping station when they are not in use to ensure they do not dry out. One key thing to remember about the maintenance cartridge is to keep it stored upright. New maintenance cartridges ship with some liquid. To ensure it does not leak, you want to make sure that it's stored upright and on a flat surface. The printer will alert you with a message on the front panel display when it's time to replace the maintenance cartridge. It is highly recommended to change out the maintenance cartridge immediately to avoid damaging the printer. It is also a good idea to check the status of the maintenance cartridge on a regular basis using the embedded web server or from the front panel display of the printer. Once the maintenance cartridge is around 70% full, you should consider ordering a new one. Now I will show you how to change an ink cartridge, print head, and the maintenance cartridge. To change the maintenance cartridge, start at the front panel display and access the main menu. Then access the ink submenu. Scroll down to replace the maintenance cartridge submenu and click OK. I will demonstrate this process.
Now, let's go ahead and change an ink cartridge. Make sure to always start this process by using the main menu on the front panel display. It's not a good idea to just pull an ink cartridge, print head, or maintenance cartridge out of the printer without preparing the system. You could actually cause damage to the printer. From the front panel display, access the main menu and then access the ink submenu. Scroll down to replace the ink cartridge submenu and click OK. Now I will demonstrate this process. Now you can remove the old ink cartridge and insert a new one. I'll go ahead and demonstrate this process now. If you've installed the ink cartridge properly, you will hear a beep and the front panel display of the printer will confirm that a genuine HP ink cartridge has been properly installed. Now I will show you how to replace a print head. From the front panel display, access the main menu and then access the ink submenu. Scroll down to the replace print head submenu and click OK. It is very important to follow the on-screen instructions. Don't try to jump ahead or skip a step. Okay? Now I will demonstrate this process. Now I will need to open the printer window. Pull up on the blue handle on the printhead carriage, remove the old printhead, and replace it with the new one. I should hear a beep if the installation is successful. I will then need to close the printhead carriage and lock it down using the blue lever. Now I will demonstrate this process. As you can see, the HP DesignJet Z6800 ink system is a bit more complex than a small format inkjet printer. Here are a few key things to remember. Install the ink cartridges, print heads, and maintenance cartridges before the warranty end date. Follow the instructions on the front panel during the installation process. Do not try to skip a step. The printer will not allow you. Allow the printer and the maintenance cartridges to clean the print heads automatically. This means leaving the HP DesignJet Z6800 powered on. It will utilize a sleep mode when it is inactive and run a maintenance cycle on a regular basis. Do not remove the ink cartridges and print heads just for the fun of it. Only replace them when they require it. The ink cartridges should never be removed while the printer is printing. They should only be removed when the printer is ready for you to replace them. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more in-depth product information, I recommend that you refer to the user's manual which shipped with your printer on a CD. Or you can download it at hp.com under the support tab.